Hi YouTube, this is an MK4 and this is going to be a quick video on showing you how to format your micro SD card. Um, if you currently don't have a micro SD card, uh, I'll just show you quickly what it looks like and how to get it in the phone itself before I format it. Um, so, put the phone down, if I just, and there's the card that I have in the, that will be formatting. Um, so, hopefully, you can see that it's a SanDisk 2GB micro SD card. That's what it looks like. Um, so if you zoom back out again, I'll just show you um, how to uh, take apart the, the Galaxy S2 um, for uh, basically installing the phone itself. Not the phone itself, the micro SD card itself. So all we do uh, on the side where you have the volume buttons, you've got a little recess there where you can take off the battery. So if I just take that off. Hopefully you can see that. There you go, it just comes off. Okay, looking back at the phone, obviously the phone's off at this point. Um, a micro SD card slot is there. Um, you should be able to see the markings for it. Um, but to get to it, you just take out the battery. Um, just use a little root to get that out. Put it, put that in there. You can see there's nothing in there. So all we do, get the micro SD card plug it in face ways up like that and it clicks in it's kind of spring loaded so once you've got it in it goes clicks in see if you need to take it out again you just push it out and, it, and just pull it out but we'll leave it in um, get the battery back in again um, and then we power on Oops, what's happening now There we go, just wait for it to boot up. Okay, the Samsung Galaxy S2 phone itself has booted back up and we're uh, at the home screen. Now to format the uh, micro SD card, um, this will obviously wipe everything on the micro SD card itself. Um, I'd recommend you do this once you get a new micro SD card just to make sure it's all the same format. Um, basically, um, so that it's something that the phone can understand and read from. Um, and then write to as well. And the phone, um, Samsung Galaxy S2, um, s can read FAT32 file system. Um, if you're interested in what that is, um, if not, all you need to know is that the file structure is called FAT32 um, for the micro SD card. Um, now, all you do um, to format the micro SD card is you go to Applications. From Applications, you go to Settings. From settings, you scroll down to storage, and from storage, you can see there a micro SD card um, is showing total, it's labeled SD card there, total space 1.84, um, available space is 1.84. <coughs> I haven't got nothing on the card at all at the moment, this is just for the purposes of showing you how to format it. Um, the unmount SD card is highlighted. Is available to click click on. Sorry, format SD card is completely grayed out. You can tap it and it doesn't do anything because the micro SD card is much like a database. Um, you can't um, overwrite a database if it's currently being used. So if the card is mounted, that means the phone is using it, and you can't overwrite all of it all in one go. So you need to disconnect the card from the phone essentially um, and then format it and the way we do that is we select unmount SD card and it says SD card will be unmounted and then give it a couple of seconds it then says um, it's changed the option from unmount SD card to mount SD card and you can then see format SD card is now enabled so what we want to do is then click uh, press format SD card and then it gives you a warning of this action will erase the SD card in the phone you will lose all data on the card obviously we know what we're doing so we press format SD card and then it asks you for a pin if you've got a pin set up I've got a pin set up so I'll just put that pin in uh, and we'll go back to it and after putting in the pin it comes up with formatting SD card will delete all data data cannot be recovered continue question mark uh, obviously another 
warning here just in case if you're making a mistake here it gives you another option to go back uh, but we're okay we want to erase everything so we press the erase everything button and it says formatting SD card then checking SD card and then it reverts the option back so the former SD card is now um, grayed out again so you can tap it doesn't do anything the unmount SD card is uh, highlighted which means the phone has linked itself with the the card it's a, it's, it's essentially mounted it uh, and ready for use and then it shows total space here 1.84 gig available space is 1.84 gig if I had anything on the phone those values would be different um, I'd recommend um, you get a micro SD card from a reputable seller uh, as there are a number of fake uh, fake uh, and micro SD cards being sold on eBay um, check out one of my other videos on how to tell um, whether or not you have a, uh, a genuine SanDisk micro SD card or a fake or a replica sold on eBay um, but that's another video um, from uh, here itself we're, we're free to uh, save anything to the card itself uh, for example if you go into the file explorer my files and then go down to um, external uh, underscore SD card um, there's nothing in there it's completely blank um, you can see the only directory in there is a standard uh, operating system directory which the phone puts there um, and that's it so that, that card is ready for use we can put apps on it we can save pictures to it and we can do uh, pretty much anything we want to it um, if you want to know how much storage space you have left on the micro SD card uh, and you particularly don't want to go through all the menus of going to uh, settings then uh, storage then finding out what's on the SD card or what's on the phone itself because uh, that's a bit of a pain another way you can see what's on the card is from the home screen or anywhere at all where you've got task manager um, select task manager and you've got tabs at the top so you've got applications to see uh, what active applications you've got open the downloaded um, application then you've got RAM but the one we're after is the one which says storage with the pie chart on uh, it gives you an overview of the storage on the phone and um, what the total storage is for uh, each particular media and what's being used so for example you can see what it says system storage I've got 663 megabytes free of a possible 2 gig um, or 1.97 gigabyte to be exact um, the USB storage can be a little bit misleading in terms of the wording um, because you think instantly I've got a USB device plugged in but no that's the phone's internal storage um, and showing it's currently there I've got 6.65 gigabytes being used uh, out of a possible 11.50 gigabytes now the one that we're interested in is the one labeled SD card now the SD card itself is showing uh, as a total of 1.84 gigabytes and out of that 64.00 kilobytes is being used which is most likely that little lost DIR folder that we saw taking up that 64 kilobytes so if you want a quick view of when uh, how much you've got left on the card uh, as I say just go to task manager select storage and it gives you um, a quick overview of what you have saves you having to go through all the menus um, and that's the video of uh, formatting a micro SD card on a Samsung Galaxy S2 smartphone running uh, Android gingerbread as I say check out some of my other videos related to the Samsung Galaxy S2 um, subscribe to my channel to um, also have a look at some of my forthcoming videos and also some of the videos are already online regarding the, the Galaxy S2 and some computer components as well. Um, any questions um, just comment below um, or if you need me to do a video on something again just comment below or just drop me an email. Thanks for watching, bye.